Hi everyone, it's Aska here. In this video, I will show you how to make very difficult trick art nails. This design, which looks like a three-dimensional braided pattern, is actually drawn using only gel. This design, which uses optical illusions, is very time-consuming, so it is not recommended for everyday use. However, please take a look at the process of how Japanese professionals draw this trick art nail design and apply the technique to your salon work. Each process is explained in detail, so please take a look until the end. Okay, let's get started! First, let's apply the base color gel. I will use this sky blue color, but any color can be used, so please use a matte color that will not show through your nails. When you have finished applying the entire surface, cure it. Next, apply two coats of the same color. One coat of paint will produce some color, but for this trick art design, the key is to apply the base color well and apply it thickly enough so that your own nails are not visible. Then, prepare a palette and take out a small amount of black. Next, use a dot pen or toothpick to draw black dots. Apply black gel to the dot pen and draw four dots diagonally from the top right to the bottom left. Draw the dots as evenly spaced as possible. Do the same thing again, this time drawing two dots on a diagonal line in the lower right corner. Draw the dots so that the pink line and the yellow line are parallel to each other. Draw two dots on the same line in the upper left corner. Once the dots have been drawn, let them cure. Next, use a long thin line brush to draw thin curved lines. First, apply black gel to the line brush. Next, use a black gel soaked brush to draw the curves alternately on the left and right. When drawing this design, keep an image of your smartphone at hand and check it from time to time as you may lose track of which line you are currently drawing. If you make a mistake on the left or right side, the trick art will not be complete, so please be careful. It is also recommended to use liner gel when drawing this black line. As the name suggests, liner gel is a gel specialized for drawing thin lines. Once you have drawn a line, now draw from the upper left to the lower right in the opposite direction from the previous step. When you finish drawing the curved line, cure it. Next, take a small amount of navy on a palette. 
Using a brush with a diagonally cut tip called the French brush, add the shadow to pattern you just created. Put a little bit of gel on the corner of the tip of the brush and apply it to create a gradient inside the curve. In this case, I used navy which is darker than blue because I used blue as the base color. If you use another color for the base color, you can choose a color darker than that color or mix a little bit of black to make it darker. Draw the shadow only the inside of the curve like this. When you have finished drawing the shadow over the entire surface, cure it. Next, since the shadow you just drew still seems a little light, draw it again in the same way to make the shadow darker. This time, I used a matte navy, but a sheer type with a translucent can also be used. If anything, the sheer type is easier to create a gradation so please try whichever you prefer. Next, mix white in the base color, sky blue, at about 1 to 1 to make a light blue color. Next, using the mixed whitish light blue, draw a thin line of light on the outside of the curve. This line is as thin as a hair, but just by adding this line of light, it suddenly becomes more three-dimensional. When the light lines has been drawn over the entire surface, cure it. Finally, apply a non-wipe top coat to the entire surface. Since unevenness will appear in the area where dots are drawn, induce the top coat to eliminate the unevenness. This completes the process. The pattern looks like a Bottega Veneta wallet. How was Trick Out Nails design? This is a very difficult and challenging design, so it would be fine to order on a nail salon, but it would be unrealistic for you to do it yourself. If you want to try it, let's practice with nail tips first. Thank you for watching. If this video was helpful to you, please hit the like button. And if you like to see more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. See you soon. Bye.